So I have to pack this entire apartment, or at least my stuff, all today because I'm moving out and then moving into a new apartment tomorrow. It's gonna be so fun. I'm not stressed at all. Um, oh, oh, oh. I feel like most of the time moving is like a bittersweet feeling, but for me, it's all sweet because I fucking hate this apartment and I'm so excited to get out and never sleep here again. But it's sad taking my pictures down, but it's okay, I'm gonna replace them with new ones and better memories. I'm doing laundry right now, I'm gonna pack all my clothes and then tomorrow my parents are coming at like 11 and then I'm gonna take apart my bed. Ugh. But it's gonna be absolutely dreadful and awful and you guys get to watch my misery. So, eh. I can't wait to have like actual walls that go up to the ceiling and a door that is an actual door and not a slider and a door that has a lock. That's gonna be so fun. That's gonna be so great to have finally after uh, a very long time. <laughs> Okay, so it's the next day. I didn't film at all because I'm super stressed out and we're all moving it into my car right now. Okay. Clown car. <laughs> I'm barely filming because I'm so stressed out and I'm just moving all my shit in. So I'll give like a little tour slash like explanation after it's all done. Right now I'm getting some lunch from my parents and then after that, gotta go back to the old apartment, still get more shit and then move that shit in. So it's a lot of shit moving and it's gonna be awful and a uh, misery. I'm kinda moved in. <laughs> Funny story, my bed decided to break. And now I have to go buy a new bed frame because it just decided to not work. So it broke. Love. So now I have to get a new bed. I have to get an air conditioner. I have to get a lot of shit. So that's really fun and lovely. And I have a fire escape. I'm gonna be smoking a lot of weed on this fire escape. never been this exhausted in a very long time like oh my god I can fall asleep right now and it's I don't have a watch what time is it it's eight and I don't care I'm tired Best Buy did not have an air conditioner so I had to order on Amazon I'm trying not to like overwhelm myself and have this affect my mood because a thing I realized about myself is that when I'm stressed out and when I'm overwhelmed, I shut down. I like shut off completely. I stop talking, I stop like reacting to things, like it's bad. So I just have to tell myself like, I'll be fine, girl. I think I'm gonna hire a task rabbit to put my bed together because I just, I can't be bothered. I really can't, like I can't. And that is okay. That's okay. I don't want to do something, so I'm not going to do it. 
<laughs> Such a good outlook on life. Ugh. Oh my god, I can't get up. I literally can't. I can't do it. So I think today I'm going to go to Urban and look at their home section because those fuckers be emailing me like literally 30 times a month. Look at our home section. So you know what? Fine. You finally got me. Your marketing tactic worked. I will come. <laughs> I will come. I'm going to breakfast with one of my friends from high school. I'm so excited to see her. Um, and yeah, it's a beautiful day out. As I said that, like, leaves, like, coming at me. Okay. Um, well, it's going to be a beautiful day, so I'm going to live it. God damn. I need to, like, write a script before I record because, like, girl. Look what I'm wearing. I'm going to put it to good use because I spent a lot of money on it. So the reason why I basically came home was to take my record player to my new apartment and I got all my records here. I'm so excited. This is why I love coming home. Listen. Silence. Fresh air. The sun is out. It's actually so nice out today. I'm gonna go outside right now. Being in the city, I love New York more than like anything but i think it's important to break it up a little bit because i think new york is very hectic and you're always around people always around people so it's nice to have i'm very fortunate that i can have this to come back to if i ever need to because i love my silence i really do <laughs> I know coffee's expensive, right? Like, I'm not gonna sit here and be like, oh my god, I just paid so much for my coffee. Like, no, I know it's a lot. But I just got an iced vanilla oat milk latte. Okay, now that I said it out loud, maybe I do understand why. But this was $8.50. Oh, it is a large. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, so I was about to complain, but this is the large, so that's why it was that money, that much money. And it's fucking delicious, so I honestly can't say anything. I look cute today. Wait. Whoa, I almost dropped it. Oh, it's so good. It's time to go to Urban Outfitters and look at the home section. I'm not expecting much because they never have shit, but hopefully it'll be something. Let's go. It's so weird when I come home because whenever I'm home, I'm reminded how different my life is when I'm home. It's kind of hard to articulate what I'm thinking, but like my life in college and my life home are like completely different things. I kind of live a double life, if you know what I mean. I don't know. It's just like, I feel like my home self is a different person than the person I am at school. Not saying I have like a different personalities, but I guess the way I live my life, because I know when I'm home, I'm more relaxed. It's just, it's just a fact. And I know it has, to, it goes hand in hand with like school and shit. But when I'm in the city, I'm just like more on edge, I think. I think since the city is so hustle and bustle, I feel like I always need to do something. But at home, I like don't feel bad about not doing anything. I don't know. I, I actually don't know. Okay, so I went to Urban Outfitters and I definitely got some shit. So I'm gonna show you guys and my parents at the same time so I don't have to do it twice. I got this little funky mirror. 
Oh, I love it. Right? To put on my wall. CP2 has a movie like, uh, not movie, a mirror like that. I'm okay. This little mirror moment, it's like a, what would you say this is? T tall organic wall mirror. Yeah, I was just about okay. to say that. These decorative little leaves, it's like I can hang them around and make it look like nature. Why are you talking in the metric system, by the way? What? You're like two meters. Because it literally says two meters each. I know, but... Yeah, let me convert it in my head. <laughs> I don't know. This Sunset is all at Urban? Yeah, spent a lot of money. Well, this is not mine. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's really cute. So this is the woman. I'm gonna put like little artificial plants in here, or maybe real plants if I can, but how cute, on the windowsill. So that's what I got. So, I don't understand why nothing ever can go right for me. Just F nothing. Not one singular thing. Nope. Mm -mm. They said, no, Steven. No, this will be hard. No. Wait, you had to break apart your bed because it wouldn't come apart? Oh, that wasn't the last of your troubles. We're gonna, like, not tell you that you need to buy the support beam separately even though it should be included in the fucking goddamn package. So, this is what I'm dealing with right now. I put my mattress inside because I need, you know, um, somewhere to goddamn sleep tonight. There's supposed to be a support beam that goes from, like, that to the other side. Ikea decided to say, wait, we're not gonna tell you you, like, need to buy that separately, and it's not gonna be included in the package. Thank you so much. I love you, Ikea. Oh, oh my. Okay. Now I have to wake up at 9 a.m. tomorrow and go get the part and finish this bed myself. So that's gonna be super fun and super lit. I was planning on showing you guys like at least a little bit of a decorated room, but I don't have time because of this inconvenience. But this is gonna have to be the end of the video because I have so much shit to do now. La, 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 la. All right. Oh, I'm so miserable. Okay. <laughs> oh my God, okay. I did technically still move in, so the title isn't really that much of a lie, but next week, next week's video, I will have a apartment tour video, whatever we have done. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> oh my God. Well, there's not much I can do now. I'm going to take off all my clothes and cry in my bed until I fall asleep. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video somehow, um, leave a like or comment something funny to cheer me up because I am so not cheerful right now. Um, subscribe, please, follow me on Instagram, please, so I can pay for the part that I have to buy tomorrow. Okay, bye.